Hello everyone, Jobexi here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Eternal Darkness. Hello everyone, we're back. This is my second play session. We're going to load the game right where we left off, uh, which was one hour, two hours and 36 minutes in. So, Alex Royvis. Let's load, two hours, 36 minutes in. The darkness comes. Also, that's not how anatomy works. I don't know if they know. But that's not how anatomy works. Okay, so if I recall, I was going to read chapter page, The Gift of Forever. So here we go. Dreams. Modern psychology offers only unproven theories. Some see them as the meaningless tossing and turning of a brain settling into a restful sleep. Others see them as laden with symbols of our unconscious desires. To still others, dreams represent the upwelling of the archetypes, normally hidden deep within the recesses of the human collective unconscious. It's of that one, one thing I am among certain. the others. It's the others. Well. After a brush with the ancients, our dreams metamorphosize into nightmares. I see. That's not very good. Persia now. So this is before Elia, but after... Before Elia and Anthony, Anthony, but after um, Bobby McRoman. What's his face? I have implored you for years. Yet you ignore all my advances. You dominate my dreams. And I can think of nothing else. I fear I desire you many hundred times more. And you love me. My life has become a waking dream, Karim. For weeks, I have dreamed of an ancient treasure so precious that it changes all life around it. It must be mine. Oh, Karim. she's caught the. If you truly desire me, as you say, the um. Then you will find this for me. Bring the stupid, this treasure really. to me, and I will be yours. Both of our dreams will come true. See? I need nothing more than you. You have enthralled me to the point where I can think of nothing else. Promise, if I leave, you will not forget about me. You need not worry. I desire nothing more than the treasure that you seek. Leave now, Kareem. And I shall await you. See, this isn't a good idea. This is so many different... No, it's... No, don't do it. It's such a bad idea. He's going to get one of the other artifacts. Which means he's not going to return to his lady friend. This is a different... Uh... We've got a talisman. What does that do? <clears throat> Long life to those who've kept it. Restore health. Okay. Chakrams. Yes. Yes, indeed. <laughs> no, they're not boomerangs. And the Dolwar. Cool. Uh, chakrams appear also in um, La Mulana, a game that I never finished. <coughs> oh, I want to check the map. This appears to be a completely different area. Was it a different set of pillars that he went to? Weird. Music's good. Oh, I don't think he made it. A man's corpse lies fallen. Wounds cover the exposed flesh of his body, where his armor has failed. The music seems louder than before. Oh, okay. 
Can I pick up this axe? I guess I don't need it. I got my own. Oh, what's over here in this corner? Nothing interesting, I'm sure. He, Kareem's not gonna make it. Man, why do all these people make real poor choices? Now he's back here. Where is this place? Pius Augustus. Hell yeah. I mean, I understand this is the place with the screaming floor. That is really cool animation for the uh, screaming stones. Cradled in what appears to be a leathery hand lies a mysterious book, bound in human skin and intricately decorated with shrunken bones. It beckons and yearns to be possessed. The answer is no, but it's probably too late now anyway, so we take it. And that wakes up all the the nasties. Oh. Okay, how's my sanity doing? You back up yet on sanity? Yeah, back to max? Good, because I want to keep the sanity at max if we possibly can. Because I don't want to be all... No, we don't need any of that. It's dark, though. I don't understand. Didn't I have a button that makes me walk strangely? I also had a button that makes me run. You don't see me? Oh, he's fine. I thought he was a trapper. To take me to the trapper realm. Oh, dang it. Best music in the game so far. A statuette vaguely resembling a man stands atop a low pedestal. Sure, let's pick it up. A crudely sculpted statuette of a man that seems particularly heavy for its size. Are we going to have button puzzles? More button puzzles? Is there a room this way? Yeah. Ooh, I found a magical rune! Or Kareem has, I guess. Oh, fine, whatever. Let's take a look at the runes while they're going. Oh, but I don't have a codex for it. Can I still make a spell with it? Uh, sure, Shatarga, this one, and this one. That's not a spell? Okay, so Shatarga, this one, and this one. It, does it not work because I don't know what it is? Shatarga, this one, and this one? Does the order on the triangle matter? I don't really know. <coughs> Boom. Oh, there's a ladder there. I don't, I don't want to do that yet. Is there a room back here or something? Map. Now that I know I have a map, I'm going to use it. Okay. Ooh, creepy. Now, is this roughly... Is this roughly the same place as we were before? An arcane shrine dominates the room. 
braziers surround its edge, while a larger one tops its summit. No doubt each one would be filled with incense to facilitate prayer to insidious deities. This game is well written. Is that protected? Where'd it go? Is that the same room that rune that I had? It appeared to be the same room. So once you have the rune, I guess you can walk through. Maybe that's how that window works. So there are four... Um, Kajunka buttons. Right? Four or three? Is it just three? Here's to be three Gajunka buttons. I don't know, the camera angles. Camera angles are getting me. One, two, three. Yeah, just three Gajunka buttons. Let's see what they do. I imagine that I need to use the statuette at some point to be a heavy item that's on something or whatever. Can I take this torch? Yes, the torch does hang on the wall. Yes, I would like it, thank you. Uh, maybe I'll equip it too. Good. No. No thanks. Blinded by the love of his lady, or by his lady's love for something or another. Do these guys not set fire? I'm gonna switch back to the sword. The total war. I don't want to fall off this side. I There's not really precedent for me being able to fall off sides. Can I not die, though? Get off of me. There's not precedent for me to be able to fall off sides like that, but... My sanity's not doing too well. So there's no precedent for me to be able to fall off the sides, but I still don't want to. Alright, here's a rune that should be... I think that's a, a different one. A codex, rather. Uh, the, I think that's a different codex for a different rune. Yeah. U Ulyoth. Oh! What's his face? Mr. Uncle Grandpa talked about Ulyoth when he talked about the multiverse several episodes ago. Sure, let's pick it up. Is that gonna make bad things happen? Can I replace it with the white one? Is that gonna do something? I'm gonna save <laughs> before I do anything else. So this is Pius Augustus before he chooses a um, thing. Just for my own personal gain. Ooh, excuse me, later. I want to keep this file for later, just so I don't have to play through the whole first 35 minutes again. So I'll save over Elia. I hope I succeed in keeping that file till the end. Oh, but I was here to use an item. Let's use this. Nope, Kareem cannot use that now. So we have the white and the black. Ageless archetypes of opposing forces. Okay, we have. There looks to be a. What? 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 Am, what? This isn't really happening. Okay. Um, are there three statues? These uh, squares that I was sinking into look to be viable places to put statuettes. Can I put one here? I can put one here. Oh, and I probably just need to stand here on the third one for something to happen. Right, because now we have all three. Oh, are those trappers? Maybe you don't see me. Ah! Oh, 
I, was I being teleported? No, the trapper got me. Uh, no. What? No. Bad. Okay, so these Trapper Realms are not safe places, and you can't save here. I would like it if I had something to refresh my, uh, health. Or, I do have something to refresh my health. I'd like it if I had something to refresh my sanity. That saps my health. This restores my magic. stick around in one place for too long. Uh, so my health is really low now. Yeah, I got teleported to the trap <clears throat> Alright, I really need to heal up. They give you fewer and fewer uses. What? Man, I only get five uses of that. Okay, that I'll have to do. Um, I do have 19 chakras. <laughs> Can I pick these back up? Am I supposed to kill them? Or just leave? They don't have eyes, right? Maybe I'm supposed to just leave. <laughs> torch for these dark portions. The crying, the baby's crying is kind of, you know, we can probably do without that, I think. Am I missing something on the map? No, I don't think so. Here's the original area. I don't think anything's changed. If I could have something to... I think it's really cool that the, uh... The camera tilts. As soon as the sanity goes away, the camera starts doing this. Um, oh, I missed my ladder. Fine, we'll go back here. Did I place the statues on the wrong... Can I have my head back? Can I have my arm now? Da -da 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 -da. So, you, we can tell this is like a fake dimension. Because, well, not only because the weirdness is happening, but uh, <coughs> we can tell this is a fake dimension because um, the not only were the trappers not there, but neither was the statue. Y'all just don't see me, it's fine. Shrine is risen from the floor, exposing what to be, appears to be a lifting me mechanism. Yes, use the device to, to 